My name is Anthony Clark. I'm originally from Gladys, Virginia. And let me tell you, if you have one year left to live, move there, because every day feels like a fucking eternity, all right? <laughs> <It's>, uh... <clears throat> I've been traveling around. I was just over in Italy with my best friend. We were traveling around in Italy together. She got ripped off while we were over there. I'll tell you what happened while we were in Italy. This woman walked up to my friend and threw my friend a baby. And when my friend caught the woman's baby, her other kids ran up and took what was in my friend's pockets. So, you know, let that be a travel tip for you, you know? <laughs> You're over in Italy and someone throws you a baby. Swat it to the ground. Yeah. Swat it to the ground and go, I don't think so. <laughs> Taking a bite out of crime. So, so, I just did this whole college tour of Texas and Oklahoma. And let me tell you, if you've never been to Oklahoma, whoo, save your fucking money, because you know who's going to go. It's right. There's nothing there. It's like a state looking for something to be proud of, is what's happening. Their state motto in Oklahoma, I swear to God, they printed right on their license plate, is Oklahoma is okay. <laughs> gotta wonder what their choices were to come up with that piece of shit. We got our five final choices for the Oklahoma state license plate program. Billy Bob, you wanna read them all? <clears throat> we have A, Oklahoma's okay. B, Oklahoma, the circus has been here twice. <laughs> C, Oklahoma, some people say we don't suck. <laughs> D, Oklahoma, trees are made of wood. <laughs> oh, they are, they are. And E, Oklahoma, Oklahoma, there, I said it twice. No, no. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, what do you want to do now? You guys are nice. You really are. I, I'm just so tired of stupid people, you know? Every time you turn on the news, stupid people. There's so many stupid people, I want to have my own game show come on 8 o'clock every night on CBS called I Don't Fucking Believe It. <laughs> I'll be the host. Welcome to the show. Our first contestant tonight is Madge from Rancho Cucamonga, California. Madge, are you from Rancho Cucamonga, sweetheart? Yes, Chuck, I am. I've lived in Rancho Cucamonga for 45 years. Worked in a bakery shop for 35 of those 45 years. The answer to your question is yes, God, Chuck, I am from Rancho Cucamonga. <laughs> okay, cool. And it says here that you are not retarded. Is that right, sweetie? <laughs> That's right, Chuck. Four clinically proven tests say that I'm not retarded. <laughs> All right, Madge, well, take a step up to this lucky wheel and give it a spin, because I don't fucking believe it! Yeah! Boom! shalaka laka laka boom You guys are so nice. You really are. This is cool. I like this job. I live in Los Angeles now, you know, and I'm in a gang. <laughs> We're not a very tough gang. We're called the Lemon Slushies. <laughs> they make you get tattoos, though. I got a gingerbread house on this shoulder. <laughs> Flower box on this one. <laughs> Our gang sign is, hey, don't walk on the grass. That was my first earthquake in California. I never experienced that before. I hope you never, ever have to go through something like that. It's absolutely horrifying, because this is what happens, right? You wake up in the morning, you're flopping around in the bed, and you're thinking, oh, great, I'm evil. <laughs> How am I supposed to make breakfast with Lucifer in my life? <laughs> Lego, my ego, Prince of Darkness. Uh, what else?
else was going on. I have pets in California. I have two cats and a chihuahua. The chihuahua is a dog for lazy people. You ain't even got to walk it. Just hold it out the window and squeak. I'm not very good with pets. <laughs> Only had one other pet. I had a pet cow when I was a kid. And my parents made me get rid of the cow because they said I was mean to it. You know, just cause one time I accidentally tried to make it eat hamburger. <laughs> eat it! Eat it, you stupid cow. I guess cows aren't into the four food groups. Especially when they are two of them. <laughs> Eat it! Eat. Do, do you like cows? I hate them. They just stand there. They don't do nothing. You can even call them. You can be like, come here, cow, come here, cow. And they just look at you like, oh, yeah, come on over. Have a glass of milk. <laughs> come on over. Eat my beef. Wear my skin. I don't give a shit. <laughs> What's that all about? I don't know. I like animals. Well, I was watching this uh, documentary on salmon. Did you know this? Just the honest to God truth. I'm not making any of this up. Where the fish, a salmon, is born or hatched in the river for half of its life. It goes down the river and out into the ocean where it feels death approach. And at that point, it remembers the very spot in the river it was born. And for the rest of its life, it struggles back up the river going the wrong way over dead trees and waterfalls and whatnot. Then it gets there to that spot and it makes love and then it dies in that very same spot in the river it was born. You know, and there's something about that that's magical. And when I think that I can't find my fucking car in the mall parking lot. <laughs> it makes me want to eat some salmon. <laughs> eat it. Stupid cow. Well, you guys have totally cheered me up. Thank you for coming out. I want to tell you before I leave, I've been so depressed. I've seen this young lady. She's originally from Ireland. She's a legal alien over here. She's not registered or anything. And I don't know what happened, but she broke up with me, so I reported her to immigration. <laughs> um, I said, I'm sorry, sweetie, if we can't be together, you got to get the fuck out of my country. <laughs> you guys have been terrific. Thank you very much. I'll see you again. Good night.